हेलो एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल आई बोवन मामा ओबसे मा मगे यूट्यूब चैनल लेकर टा साधरेन पिलेगानो होताई उन आधे दावसे दी मामा ओबटा तवात अलूत्म विधिये कटा इंग्रीसी वचनेटिका एवा गे मा वाक्यराटा की प्याक उगानवन नहीं सूदानम बेरने मैं पार्टम आवश्यक में ने कहाँ होंडी बला आगे नहीं दला अद दवसे दियो बिगन गानवा ओबे वाग माला वो वचन देन मुवार्दने कर गान दवश्य विविध वचन की प्याक वागे म विविध वाक के रटा की प्याक है भाई माम मैं पार्टम करा अन्य उबात तेक कला कर कर मेरा टापी की ना टास्क बेस लर्निंग किया ला एक � मामे के इंग्लिश वालिंग किया ला आवश्यक ना सिंगल नोट किया अन्ना इतना कोटा इंग्लिश वालिंग किए न दे करांड बलांडा बेरू नॉट उत्साह करांडा मामे सिंगल इंग किया दिए के तेरुंगा रगन एविधिये टा करांडा इतना ओएविधिये टा दिगटा मेवा के टास्क बेस लेनी ना पिकेनो आटे टीबीएल किया ला में कार्या क कोटु की प्याव। Now, first of all, I want you to look at these squares. How many squares are there? There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 squares. How many squares are there? There are 7 squares, one below the other. Vertically. Now, this from top to bottom, it is vertical. I have written seven squares vertically from top to bottom. If you count, you can see seven squares. Square. You know what square is? The first square you can see and the last square down there, there is a square. So, all together there are seven squares here. Now, you can solve this puzzle by doing what I ask you to do. Okay, now you can see seven squares, one below the other. What I want you to do is to follow my instructions. Okay, I will ask you to write some letters in each and every square. मामले देंगे वो ऐट किए ना मैं एक-एक स्क्वायर्स वाला आकुर आकुर लिए अंड किए ला मैंने मैं आकुर लिए ना कोटा वंस यू कंप्लीट ऑल द सेवेन स्क्वायर्स यू विल फाइंड अ नेम ऑफ अ बर्ड व्हिच कैन रन वेरी फास्ट आई विल शो यू पिक्चर आल्सो एस अ क्लू देन लर्न द वर्ब्स नेम एस वेल लेस some other words. You can learn number of prepositions. You can learn to understand English and follow instructions. So, from this task, you can learn many things to develop your English. It may task ke kalot, obate English bhasha dhen mu divnu karagan buho de labino meke. Hari, api hinam balamu. Now, all what you have to do is to Write the letters that I ask you to write in different squares. Okay. Now, write A, letter A in the middle square. Okay. Now, you write A in the middle square. Can you do that? Write A, letter A in the middle square. Now, you must be able to understand what middle is. Okay. That is the first instruction. Write A in the middle square. Okay, do it. Okay, now write H, letter H in the bottom square. Write the letter H in the bottom square. You know top and bottom. Write H in the bottom square. Okay, I am waiting till you write it. Write letter H in the bottom square. Okay. Now write I 
below the letter R. Write the letter I below the letter R. Now, letter R you wrote in the middle square. So, now write I below the R, below that letter R. Now, you know what below, above, under, like that. Okay. So, now you must have written I under A or below letter A. Please try it. Now, between H and I, you write C. Write letter C between H and I. You know the preposition between. You have learnt it many times. Now, write letter C between H and I between H and I. You know where you wrote I. Now, you write C between H and I. Okay. Now, I want you to write letter T. I want you to write letter T. But remember, you must write this T under S. You must write this letter under S. But it should be written between O and T. O and T. Now you decide where to write O and T. You must write only one T. Okay. That T must come under S under S. This S should be between O and T. This S should be between O and T. Can you understand this? If you write these letters, you can find the name of a bird which can run very, very fast. Well, let us see whether you did it. Now, I shall repeat that with singular meaning. Okay, let's see. First, look at the squares. There are how many squares? Seven squares. I want you to write R in the middle square. Write R in the middle square. I want you to write R in the middle square. Matona Vala Madakotue R Lian. I want you to write R in the middle square. Then I want you to write H in the bottom square. In the bottom square, please write H. Ekiane Pahalamatiana. Yatamatiana kotue H Lian. Now I want you to write I just below A. I want you to write I just below A. The matona wala lianda are R regate yatin e ekame yatin ayakura. I want you to write the letter I just below the letter A which you wrote in the middle square. Are we a medakot will yip R regate ekame yatin I lianda. Now, I want you to write letter C between H and I. Now, I want you to write letter C between H and I. Then, what I want you to write under H akurai, I akurai, atar meddi, between ken atare, between H and I, please write letter C. Now, you completed four squares. In the middle square you wrote R. In the bottom square you wrote H. Just below the R you write I. Then you wrote C between I and H. Now there are another three squares left. Then it will be squares to now. You can write only one T. What Puluang eka T akurakli and you can write only one T in one of the three squares left. 
ඔය ඉතුරු වෙලා තියෙන කොටු තුනෙන් එකක වට ටීලි යන්න පුළුවන් බට් යු මස් රයිට් ඉට් බිලෝ එස් යු මස් රයිට් ටි බිලෝ එස් විච් යු ආ ගොයින් ටු රයිට් යු මස් රයිට් දැට් එස් බිට්වීන් ටි ඇන්ඩ් ඕ you can write only one t what pulwa ek t akura iliyanda but that t should be written below s it should be written below s under s s should be between t and o a s akura tiyenna ona between o and t if you have completed the squares with the letters i mentioned you can find the word that describes or that gives the name of a bird which can move very fast what is this bird what is this bird's name right and if you have found the word please write it below under the comment section right let us see how many of you can find the word and i hope you have studied number of prepositions below under middle between also you learn some sentences e wage moya wakya keepekut igena gatta mama puluwan taran sinhalat bhavita kala iting mena me vidihata task based learning යමක් කර කර ඉංග්‍රීසි ගන ගන්නකොට ඒ ඉංග්‍රීසිය ස්වාභාවික විදිහට ඔයාගේ මනස තුලට යනවා. ඒතකොට ඉංග්‍රීසි කතා කරන්න මේ වගේ දැන් ඔබත් උත්සාහ කරන්න මේ වගේ දෙයක් කෙනෙකුට කියලා කරන්න. එතකොට ඔබට පුළුවන් ඊට අපහසු වෙන මේ භාෂාව ඉගෙන ගන්න. ඉතින් භාෂාවක් ඉගෙන ගද්දි මේ වගේ ප්‍රායෝගිකව කර කර ඉගෙන ගත්තොත් තමයි හරියට මේ අපිට භාවිත කරන්න පුළුවන් වෙන්නේ. ඒ නිසා मम इदिदि तवा विशेष पाड़ कीपयाक्तुन वाट भाषा वथाकंड लियांड एवगम कीवल तेरुंगंड अवश्यवन पाड़ रस गेन बलापुर एनिसा दिघटम मगे यूट्यूब चानल का इन्न अदत् समुगण मुहूर्त मम उंगिलासी नो उबता मगे चानल का सब्सक्राइब कर लम सब्सक्राइब कर इवागेम मे पाड़ हृदय के लिए लाइक हे गुद्दाल मे पाड़ उबे यहालुलियो सहोदर सहोदरियो समग शेयाकर गेक्कम मे पाड़ पीली बंद उबे अधहस उदहस योजना इवगेम चोदना नीव नौन पहल कमीन सुलदान तम तक उदय थी आय तवात् मे वगे पाड़ अरगन उभ मोटेन बलापुर अदर समुगा गुड बाय एंड गुड लक